Hello and welcome to another episode of Lemur's Corner. I am Lemur and today guys we are on our PvE server. You guys can see our new barn, our diving pen, our bait base, our bird pen, our quats, all that we got from Eagle, which he did solo. And then our giant ramp, that's our total base right now. However, we our barn is very, very empty. So we are gonna go ahead and do a mass taming spree. We're gonna tame things that are high level and we're just gonna grab them and start taming the heck out of them. So I'm really excited for that. So we're gonna jump on our Quetzal, start grabbing stuff, dumping it in here, taming it, and it's gonna be a blast. Deadly's gonna be helping me out. We might tame stuff on the fly too, so we might have extra dinos with us. We'll figure it out. But we'll see you guys here in a minute when we get everything together, when it's morning, when we find stuff and we start taming everything known that we can find as you guys can see we've only got controls raptors scorpions I've got a megalosaurus I've got a miso uh, which is a monkey and then we have some dodos so I will see you guys here in a moment when we are ready to start taming some stuff all right guys we are back and we are back on the hunt for some dinosaurs so let's go ahead and get them we got a parasaur right here he's 150 we're gonna drop him in our tame pit knock him out tame him move on to the next one so we're just gonna keep taming stuff knocking it out taming it and let's see how much stuff we can get done in the uh, time frame of the video so uh we're gonna go ahead and fast forward to transporting we'll just show you guys knocking them out taming them and we'll keep it very simple for you guys so you guys aren't watching this we'll lift and drop it's gonna be kind of annoying, and we'll show you guys our, our haul at the end of it. I'll show you how many dinos we've made and all that kind of stuff, and how many are made, how many dinos we've caught, and all that kind of fun stuff. So we'll see you guys when I get back to the base. But I'll show you guys on this one run. This will be the first run. I'll show you what the plan is. Pretty much, I'm gonna go knock it out, run over, and then go ahead and get berries for it. Once I got berries in it, then we're just gonna tame it, and then it's just gonna be the next one, and the next one, and the next one. I plan on getting at least your boas, some equuses. And anything else we can hide that's find that's high level. We want to do high level because if we want to breed it, and we can choose to breed it and make higher levels and have stupid ridiculous parasaurs that run around and murder everything. So as we come in here, guys, you guys have seen my taming pen before. It's just a simple two box system that you walk up, you drop it in, you knock and you knock it out, and you walk away. It's very simple. So let's go ahead, get this thing in here. Once we get over the top of it, there we go. Kind of drop it in there. There it is, it's in. Jump down. And here we go. I'll go knock this baby out real quick. With this baby, so you guys can see it's a 150. Should almost be knocked out at this point, I would think, but it's being difficult. Five, and there we go. So it's out. And now all I'm gonna do is go pick some berries, run back over, and get that thing taming. So it should be a simple process, guys. As I said, I'm not gonna make you guys have to watch all of this. So we're just gonna go ahead, play some good music. We're gonna go ahead and just go ahead and rock out a bunch of taming. So I'm just gonna go ahead and record the background. And if anything funny happens, obviously we'll go ahead and do that kind of fun stuff with it also. But it's just going to be a fast forward. You guys are going to watch us pin a bunch of stuff. And at the end, we'll talk about what we've got. And maybe do a little base tour at the end. As you guys have seen, our base is growing quite substantially. You know, we did kind of a quick work overall. So let's get our berries in here. Boop, boop, boop. Just whatever I've got. I'll throw it in here. It's not a big deal. You can have it all. doesn't matter. And off we go. So we got berries. He's taming. We're done with them. On to the next one. I'm actually going to turn these off automatic mode in this situation just because I want them to be able to go in and out. So um, there we go, and there's that. So we'll see you guys here in a minute as we continue to change stuff.
What level is it? Is it 60? I tried to, we're gonna sweep through each other? No, go for the vultures first. Oh, well, I attacked the rex. Try to come to me. Trade, exchange, blows here. Oh god! Ah, my chest piece! Circle of Doom! Circle of Doom! I've got a bunch on me. There's two of us. We got him, I think. I think it's the Vultures. <laughs> oh, there's still one more right here. Yeah, I'm gonna take some stamina. I'm gonna take a moment with that stamina. Stamina! Oh, you got two on you. One. Oh, you, oh, you got, 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 like, three on you. I'll line them up for four. four. I know, baby. There's just no one stop! There's, There's four. four! Did we just kill a bunch? Yes! <laughs> the course is my four. Ooh, 150. That's oh. nice. Alright. Hi, Rexy Poo. Let's get it. Uh, uh, can I get stamina first? Nope. Oh, you're on your own. The damage is getting this six taking. <laughs> we are mauling this thing. <laughs> mauling it. It's bleeding. Alright, and welcome back. So, woo! That was a little rough one right there, guys. So we made it through. We got everything we needed. We got not everything we needed, but we got a mass dinos. Deadly got a cool, some cool stuff for us. You guys missed some of these. I unfortunately missed some recordings and lost some points in there for some of this stuff. But you guys can see we got a pretty, pretty good haul right here. You guys can see Deadly got his little dimorphodon. He's kind of cool, actually. If people really get up close to him. So we got some cool dinos. We're gonna find some spots for them, but we got some bigger dinos, so that means we need to make our large dino pen. So that's what we're gonna do on the next episode, guys. Is we're gonna focus on that large dino pen. But as I said right at the end of this episode, we are going to go ahead and talk about a uh, new build that we're gonna be looking at, or not new build, a base tour. Um, I'm also going to be building a new manufacturing room in here for you guys, so you guys can see, because this is where my manufacturing is right now. It's nice, but it's not the best. I want to kind of get a better way of it running because you guys can see we've got our nice little indie forge and everything in here but i'm going to build a cool little octagon base it's going to be really kind of fun that we're going to make i'm also going to use standard stuff for this s plus base so uh, i'm actually going to turn it into a tutorial we're going to call it the end game base but i'm just running through my stuff here guys so you guys can take a peek at it check it out see what the whole base looks like in general kind of run around and show you guys what we got going on here you guys can see our awesome little dino pen here. We're going to run up here real quick. I'll run through here. I'll show you guys the inside. You don't need to see every single one. All kinds of cool stuff in here. Dinos in there. Um, we've got our little Megalosaurus in there. Megalosaurus or Megalosaurus. 
I always forget which one's which. And then of course we got the second floor on this guy too. It's our dino pen with our little secret rooms of fun stuff on the sides. And then we have our ramp over here. Uh, we're going to put our large dino pen, I believe, over by the ramp or possibly on the base of the ramp section. I haven't fully decided on where we're going to put that yet, but I am going to put my crafting room up in this general area, so we're going to use that. But here is our ramp. I got fully that turned around for a second, and we're going to stare at this rock for a second, guys, because, you know, we all know rocks are amazing. So our ramp's right over here. We might do something. I might put my crafting area over here or something, but here is our ramp. It looks really nice. It's clean, flush, walks up, bam, walks down. It's a huge ramp, really thick. Get anything up and down it. That's the key on that one. So we're going to go ahead, get up here. That's my dino pen right there. And we'll get to the last one over here on the corner once I get through this little section. We'll just jump into the water real quick. Splunk. And here we go. And we're going to run over here to our air dino pen. This one's kind of just chilling on the little sector right here. We're running around, kind of giving you guys the ground view. I know I'm going to do an air view of it and run in there. But you guys can come check it out, see all the birds in there. We've got double doors up top. You can get out the backside with your dinos and everything. And it's really cool because it's just right out here on a cliff. You guys can see it's kind of a nifty little build right on the side and everything. And we have the transparency up and everything. So uh, that's it for this one, guys. Uh, if you guys want to see me start doing a regular tour every episode so you guys can see it really quick that's fine we can also just tour the old stuff but as i said there's going to be two new buildings hopefully on the next episode there'll be one i'll do on a tutorial on the off time and then there's going to be one that we're going to do on camera and that's going to be specifically a large dino pen so that's what we're going to focus on for the next little bit and i hope you guys have enjoyed this video and of course if you're new to the channel make sure you guys subscribe to the channel and always give us that thumbs up let us let us know that you like that video and as always, leave a comment down below what you guys want to see. If you guys want to see us tame anything, uh, we are working towards ascension. We are going to start taming some rexes on the backside. So if you guys see some rexes coming around and breeding and all kinds of fun stuff, so we're going to make a breeding room and all kinds of cool stuff. We're going to kind of keep them in one area. That's why Deadly's going to help me build my large dino pen. And we'll probably do the next episode right after that, a big giant breeding room so we can breed tons of eggs and all kinds of fun stuff. So I hope you guys... Have enjoyed this one, and as always, guys, make sure you guys have a fantastic day, and we will see you on the next episode of Lemur's Corner.